Hello, welcome to Oceanhorn. This is a first impressions of the game here. This is the game that was just released today. Pick of a jar with the action button. Okay, action button is space. Let me throw it with space again. Alright, get some coins. I was seeing there is quite a bit of... Um, it, the game seems it's similar to Zelda. Let's see if, if that holds up here. Open the chest, get some more coins. The box over here can break that. Dude. Did you sleep well, kid? Do you still have the same nightmare? Your father often visited the island on his travels when he was younger. Well, that's cool. Oops. Sorry, man. Alright, let's see what's in here. So, the concept of this game is. Ooh, chest. Need a master key. Of course, I do. I mean, the concept of this game is you are your father went to go destroy the ocean horn. And that's how he lost your his his wife or your mother. Um, okay. Okay, so there are checkpoints. Cool. So lost the mom. Dad went to fight the monster. Told you. Sun. <laughs> Ceramic. Alright, let's do this. Uh. Uh. Did you just stick cool? Okay, and let's see. Where are we going? We're supposed to find Daddy's sword and shield. That's like our objective right now. That's all we got is a stick. stick. Um, let's see, is there anything in here? Oh. Oh, what's down here? Let's go down here. Uh, anyone that comes near me is going to get squashed by a barrel. If there is anything here. Oh, okay. Uh, knew that barrel was going to come in handy. Push objects with the action button. Okay, I'm guessing that that's going to Okay, there we go. Little puzzles. That's gonna be interesting. This game does look pretty good. Pretty good. Um, I'm pretty impressed with this so far. It was just released, I think, today. Uh, I just went through, saw what, th what release date was in Steam, wanted to pick out a new game. So that's what we'll go. We got the key to the main door. So we'll go open that now. That's where the middle mouse button can move your camera slightly. Not too much, though. Now, do the ones with the dots stay down? Yes, they do. Okay. So if it has a dot, it will stay down. Got a little bat bird thingy. I think it's going to be a timed one, though. This is a reset button. Magically returns. Up to the original. Okay, cool. So they return some back so you can start the puzzle again if you got stuck. Okay, so that little button is a reset button. Oh, okay, so you have to get both of these down. Okay, is that a rock? I can pick that up. Okay. So the rock on one. Is this bat? Is this bat got problems? You got beef? You got beef, son? You got beef? I don't think so. Hey, now are they timed? Like, is it having to stay up? 
It's okay. I've gotten there. All right, your mother's necklace. Seems like it says no ordinary pendant. Let's see what else we got. Da 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 da. Found your mother's sword. You bought your sword and shield. Awesome. All right. Look at this. And I got 50 ruples. Okay, so we just hit it. All right. Which one is the block? I think it was right bumper. No, space sh shift. Okay, shift is my shield. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay. It's neat. Level up. Press escape. You're a traveler. You got your health refilled and 10 coins. Cool. Level 2 traveler. Make our no way up. Okay, we got cool. Okay, and we'll take and go fishing too. And we'll, we'll try to see if we can find the fishing stuff. Okay, it's neat. Okay, that green bar is my stamina. Okay, and then I have the hearts for health. What's this? I have to say, does Teppo the archaeologist does seem very inspired by Zelda. So, like by the music and the uh, animations and whatnot. Saved. Awesome. Ladder. What does it say? Hermit's picnic spot. We're a smart guy now. So we get out. Ooh, yeah. Rough. Explore crystals. It gives you 25 XP. Okay, so the gem like experience. Okay, so some things are too tall, too too too, too high to drop off of. Can go swimming. Okay. Go around. Okay. Okay. Master key. Where are we gonna get a master key? Hmm. I feel like we need to get to the boat. <laughs> Stacking them. Okay. What does the hermit say again? Is the hermit still here? Yeah, you found your father's sword and shield. How did you get your hands on them? 
I'm supposed to have them later. What? Well, this night was starting to grow, glow. How could it be so stupid? <laughs> that is one of the symbols of ancient Arcadia. Follow me, I have a story to tell you. A long to skip time these. ago, these islands were the mighty oh, voice is of lovely. Arcadia. I was totally wrong about his voice. I'm so the sorry. The Age of Enlightenment led Arcadians to outstanding scientific discoveries. Engineering and magic ran deep. A foul war began as Dark Lord Mesmeroth, who had once been a promising candidate for an Archmage, led dire folk armies to a war against Arcadia. With the aid of his dark magic and the dire folk, Mesmeroth dug deep into the ground and brought to daylight something that should have stayed in the depths of the earth. Triloth, a mass of dark energy left over from the creation of the world. Black boats arrived to the gates of Arcadia, carrying the dark energy Triloth. Soon the light from the world and from the hearts of men faded. The once flourishing society disappeared into the darkness. After the catastrophe, three sea monsters appeared. One of them was Ocean Lord. born under the dark, burning light of Triloth. Although all of these monsters were powerful, only one has survived up to this day. Oh, it is getting late, kid. Return to me in the morning. Now the dark, burning light that sort of, uh, Like, like, ironic, isn't it? To be like a dark light. Okay, so our mini map actually gives us a spot of where we need to go. I'm assuming I still don't have the key, so. thinking I need to go back in here. I'll go to bed. Alright. Oh, no. Was that a pig? Pig mask? Oh, it's a gas mask thing? Hmm. Just chilling. I'm assuming the guy's gone. Back to the lovely music. What you doing here, huh? It's so rude, I see like random machines and I just randomly start to- Oh no, never mind. have attracted these star creatures just as your father feared monsters and evil forces have disturbed the balance of the world your destiny is tied to ocean horn just like your father's it is no use to hide any longer all right so old scriptures tell about sacred emblems relics that hold the power of gods their purpose was to maintain the balance of the world but they lost their power in the catastrophe at the same time as Oceanhorn appeared. I believe that was no coincidence. To unravel the mystery of Oceanhorn, you must find out what happened to the sacred emblems. Here is what I know of them. The emblem of Earth that belongs to the Aru people is hidden in the Perta Desert, 
that was once a vast and beautiful forest. Most of its beauty withered along with the Aurus, wise and fearless building. The emblem of ocean belongs to Gilfolk, the people living in the waters of the world. Hey, look. Emblem of Ocean like? is a relic of their long past glory and former power. I can't remember the name from the uh from Zelda. Little water creature, so. The emblem of sun was the pride of Arcadia. A symbol of hope and determination for our kind. I will tell you more about it later. It is time to begin your journey. This is the only way to get to Oceanhorn and find out what happened to your father. Pickerel. That's a nice name. Pickerel Island. This key. Open the door to the pier. Boat is kept. Alright, got that key to that boat. Map here. It's me, Kermit. Kermit. I can talk to you through the mysterious seashell. Maybe I can be answered on your request. Oops. Let's not do that. Alright. Okay, so this is Tekarel. Okay, so we want to go. Automated. This compass. Beautiful day. Have a safe trip. Okay. You too, bud. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> the water's pretty neat. Some random floating island. Some. some uh, Ram things floating in the uh, floating in the water, litter. We're gonna hit that. Oh, okay. Um, can you can you not do that? <laughs> Where are we going? Why are we here? Hmm. Well. Done. Okay, right mouse button is the compass. Okay. Oh, okay. So we have to go here. Okay. So we like scroll out. These arrows don't seem to do anything. It's just odd that. Oh man. Oh, right. Let's actually click the place we need to go. Oh, you can click and drag. Look at that. You gotta click and drag. Okay, what am I doing? Alright, so you actually do draw your course. Okay, so you have to click and drag to move the map, but you can click and drag where you actually want to go. And you follow that course. It's like, okay, so that's that landmass right now. So if I just draw a straight line, there we go. There we go. All right. Look at me finding out how to do things. I have to say, this music is quite uh, inspirational, isn't it? Lovely music. I do dig the soundtrack. I 
It's a bird. Hello, bird. Apparently there's fishing. Saw that in the uh, skill tree, skill area. I haven't seen anything about that yet, though. So, I mean, we're only like, what, like 20 minutes in, so we'll see. Protect with peace. Move crates and other objects a hundred times. What a wonderful little village. You know, this was the life I always imagined for myself. There's no time to rest, though. I'll just ask for directions and move along. I love to watch boats sailing and take rail. Not long ago, I saw a weird back boat land on the other side of the island. Who was that? I don't know. It's creepy though, huh? What am I doing here? Okay, I'm going to talk to you. Going into your house now, lady. Mr. Phil is displeased. He heard somewhere of a rat problem. I said that the only rat in my warehouse is my assistant. But when I came home, I saw a fat one right next to the barrels, and it wasn't you. Deal with it. Oh, well, I dealt with it. I dealt with it. I dealt with it, okay? I dealt with it. Just wonderful. You can use them up, to use them to open new paths and blow up blocking objects. You'd like to buy from some bomb island if you have a chance. It's a bomb island, apparently. That's neat. Last year, I took part in this stupid trip to Withered Lands. I was hoping to see an Aru temple, but all I saw was an empty wasteland, and I got sand in my boots and burned my skin. Why would anyone want to go there? Even the most fearsome enemy has it. Weak spots, try different tactics on them. There's no shame in escaping. Master Adventure. Your adventure level will rise as you slay monsters, take on challenges, and get achievements. Those blue diamonds represent your experience, and depending on how many you have collected, the Adventures Guild will grant you a matching level. You can always check the menu to see how many diamonds you have to collect to reach the next level. Spend your money. Never start a venture without visiting Takara's shop. Sponsored message. Lol. It's unlikely you will reach the master adventure level. <laughs> Thanks. It's unlikely. You will be good. Okay, well, I want to see what we gotta do. What do we gotta do here? Um, too much talking. Again, getting too much. There's too many people talking. Lady. The festival sun is coming while father is busy working preparing his fireworks known as allowed to go to Hummington Hill. Humming Hill before his work is finished. Cool. Uh, 
Mm. Well, how am I supposed to? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? A red dot. Oh, not cool. It's gone now. Not coming out, huh? Coward. Same entrance, really? No, it's a different entrance. Okay. It's just a little little tunnel takes you in a circle. Okay. It's very much of a uh, like a self-exploring type of game. It doesn't tell you where you gotta go or what you gotta do. Hearts always cut the tall grass. That's what we learned today, kids. Bomb Island. That random sandbar. Let's go around it. No? Let's see what's over here. Oh. 
because I'm, I'm actually kind of lost right now about what we're supposed to do. It's cool, they save the uh, tax run when you talk to it. You gotta find something to do. And it's supposed to be an RPG, so it's supposed to be that whole find it out yourself sort of thing. But I always like giving a little bit direction, so you know, so I'll know what to do. I do like the travel thing, but I don't like the. Let's see, find find your first piece of heart. Defeat. Things. They say this was the, other the one. place where Triloth was excavated. Now people come here either to work at mines or buy bombs. They say you should never enter caves or dungeons without some bombs. Could be some puzzles in there, I guess. You want some cool? Welcome to Bomb Island, the bomb maker's house to buy bombs. That's what this guy has to say. I was walking a hill nearby, I fell into a hole. I saw something shimmering in the dark. But I was too afraid to find out what it was and climbed up quickly. Okay, so we're looking for holes. Combat's not so great though. So far. Geronimo! I can't just climb up there, apparently. Bombs in here. Just be able to just leave bombs lying in chests. Nope, piece of heart. Well, that's straight out of Zelda. <laughs> so you get four heart pieces and you get. Earned a new level. Press escape. You got a pumpkin seed gun for your boat. Pumpkin seed gun. Pretty snazzy. Pretty snazzy. Seems like there's no skill tree or anything. It's just one person making progression. Let's see. Okay. Well, that was that was cool. So we gotta try this again now. Back. 
cool. We never even had a chance. Is there any way I can climb over this? No, I need a bomb. Maybe I can throw it over there. Do something. Or not. Nope. Yeah, nope. Um, so let's go get out of here then. I guess that's that's it. Nothing else here for me to do. Seen two of those things now, though. Okay. No way for me to get up there. That's chained. Where did I hit this? Anything? Tomb here, so it tells us what to do. Sailor Stone. I salute thee, O wind. Cleanse my soul with your breath and protect me from sudden death. Take me back to my home so dear before the storm falls over the day so clear. I salute thee, O wind. I salute thee, O wind. There's this little I think you gotta blow those up. Seen those big, I've seen those red things. They, they have something to do something. They, they, they do something. I just don't know what they do yet. What do? Rusty, this old statue that stood here for centuries. Uh. Alright, let's grab that respawn point. Alright, so there's the mine. I guess we can get there from here. I wanted to go over here first, see what else is over here. And we'll go in that mine. Bridge is not safe, use the gate instead. Um, do it! Ah. Fifth time's the charm. Some coin. something. Okay, let's go back to where we're supposed to go. Actually, I can't go back to where we're supposed to go. Doesn't look like there's a way to cross it. Okay, 
Old abandoned mines. Oh, okay, so this resets everything. Okay, I see what I gotta do. Push it there, that'll get stuck. So we gotta push it this way. We just gotta push it right here and walk it straight over. Duh. Derp. 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 Find a key. Okay. Well, I don't think so. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Okay, this one should stay down because it's a little dominant. Alright, what do we get in this chest here? Regular key. Awesome. <gasps> that rock, son. Next baddie I see is getting in the face. We really need some some health. So I'm like in one shot kill range right now. Wait for me to get up here. Okay, so this is the exit. Okay, so once uh once I go down this way, I'm stuck down here. <laughs> I stoned him. <laughs> oh good lord. That's why these things are abandoned, huh? We have to Still not right. 
try this one more time. Actually, maybe, maybe more than one more time. Oh, I see. Push this one this way. That was right. But we gotta push this one that way. Okay, now we can push this one this way. That one over once. And voila, look at that. I told you, third time's a charm. This bat's just laughing at me the whole time, too. Regular key. Awesome. Trying to get help. That's how these red things do. things. Probably need a bomb or some sort of torch. Okay. Well, I don't have any way to light those right now. We'll just open this door. See what's in here. Note. We managed to destroy the wall with sounds coming from behind it. All of a sudden the ground crumbled under the man's feet and they fell down to the giant centipede's lair. I was lucky to get out, but I was one of the few. I locked the door. The fire puzzle is enough to keep the, keep the key safe. So there's a fire puzzle. So I am gonna need to do something with something. else. I don't think that's going to cut it. Hmm. I don't know, man. Maybe we have to light the furnace and get a coal or something. Get some Need something other than this here. complicate these things, man. Okay. Those fire flare effects, man. Got the master key. That is the mob master door. I can tell. Oh, 
Oh, okay, he is a moment. He was gonna tell me something before he died. Alright, regular key, open the door. And that lowers the door. Okay, we get something special here. Old boot. Found one coin inside. Awesome. Old boot with one coin. Hashtag swag. Can't just walk down. All right, let's fight this centipede, man. We're just gonna jump down into this hole. Do it, Geronimo! <laughs> Okay, so there's two giant centipedes. I have those close to them. saved. We finished. So we just gotta get out of here now. How do we get out of here now? Excellent question. Nothing in here. Hmm. This is gonna be interesting. little things. Okay, so we gotta push this over there, and that's just the exit. So there's two chests up here, though. Why can't I push them? Nope. Okay. Well, we're moving on. Oh, look at that. Here's the master chest. Awesome. So that is R. Let's try that. It's right here. Please controls. Right mouse button. Wow. What a scroll. Okay. I see now. I get it. A shell. Five coins for that. Point five XP. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm going to get out of here. And let me know if you want to see more videos like this one. Oh. Thanks. Have a great day.